Hello, this is Callum and welcome back to my Let's Play on Minecraft Storm Mode Season 2. This is part number 3 of episode number 3, Jailhouse Block. In the last episode, we got demoted to guest, and we're now in the zombie mines, and that gate there is basically our way to Prisoner X, because she's basically a prisoner that knows the maze in order to get out of this place, so we need her help, pretty much. So let's go have a look at the gate. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Um. Stay away. Yeah, dumb. I was not telling. Yeah, what dummy would want that, huh? Yeah, Prisoner X hates everyone. Even other guests like yourself. Don't even think about going in. Alright, fair enough. Gotta be another way to open this door. You know, you could just mine it, I guess, but... I think we just need a bit more of a logical problem. There's a whole hole in the wall. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood. He's down for a while and headbutted the wall. Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Ooh. So this redstone looks like it powers the door. If I can bypass it... Then it'll open. Hey guys, over here. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Hey, Jesse! Stop loafing around! Shut up! Well... There is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. God damn it! So we need, I'm guessing we need like a leather or something to get past this. Um, I'm guessing so anyway, so we'll have to have a bit of a nosy. I was talking to her. You know, Jesse, guests and associates really shouldn't be mingling. Don't care. Yeah, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. You want the truth? I'm trying to escape. As much as I admire you actually telling the truth, there's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. He doesn't need to know, really does he? I prove myself to get this gig as it is. Not giving it up for you. But he's why you're down here. Come on. And he is who will help lift me back out again once I finish helping him run this horrible, smelly mud pit. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Uh, you know, a power and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. Then who's running they it then? They'll be just... Oh, yeah, who am I kidding? I have done so much for them in the past. I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look. Maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Oh, good for you, isn't it? Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero. Or you know what? Fine. Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. Swear to God, is she, if she's still a miserable git to come back to levers. after all this, I'm going to be so annoyed. Alright, so... And do it is this how you make it? Yeah, yes it is. I can't believe I actually had to look up what how to make a lever. There we go. Okay, let's do this. Beautiful. What the hell is that? Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself! Alright, let's do this. Oh no! There's a lot of them. Oh yes, some fighting. Alright, let's go. Right, let's try and dodge. Ho, ho, ho. 
Okay, get my stamina back up. I must go for the kill. Uh, oh god, there's a few behind me. I need to back off. Get my stamina back up, and then go for this. Go for the kill. Okay, stamina back up again. Uh, and then we're going. There we go. Light the man on fire. Crap. Go, 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 go. There we go, boom. Guys, come on. Luna. Stella, you guys too. Don't! Prisoner X will escape! Oh hell no, I don't care about that. No! God damn it. I thought that would work. Oh no. Hey yo, what? What the heck was this? Where? Stay close to me, okay? Where's everyone gone? Guys. Petra! Petra? Oh no! What happened to her? Oh, of course. Oh, hey, Admin. Of course, it's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? Admin? It's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom, tried to upset the delicate order of the Sunshine Institute. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? Pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities. Well, after you came to Beacon Town and wrecked everything, it seemed like the least I could do. It's terribly rude, is what it is. Oh, hey, Warden. Eh. <laughs> Edmund! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I, I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day. I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you. Oh, begin with. nothing personal. Why do you have to go and make it harder? I had to get out of this prison. Nothing personal, Warden. Oh, sure, nothing personal. Just my whole reason for existence. Oh, for the love of... Enough! How thrilling you disappoint me! Oh! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. Oh, yeah. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. What the hell is going on here? Now. So, unless you want to be added to my naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. Oh no, don't tell me I have to fight Petra. And as for you, Jesse, well... Don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> oh no, I'm not doing that. Now we'll have some real fun. No! No, we're not doing that. I had such high hopes. Um, do I have to? I think I might have to. Come on, Petra. Could have been my champion. You gave it all away. Ow! I just see those moves there, though. What the hell? What is that? Petra, what are you doing? I'm so sorry, Jesse. Oh no, this isn't good. Are you afraid, Jesse? I get over it quick if you are. I was back off. Back off. I might have to. I don't want to fight Petra, though. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Pop. Pop. <laughs> this is actually intense. There we go. No, I can't. This isn't happening. 
Yeah, I'm not doing this anymore. Oh, jeez. Serious, ouch. Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack it. Just trust me on this one. Alright, let's do this. At least Petros hasn't actually turned on her side. On his side, even. Right, let's go. Now, Jesse! Adio! Alright. I don't think this is gonna work. Knew it. <laughs> you're, you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Alright. Uh-oh. All I ask you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that! I don't even want you to be my friend anymore! And I don't want you to be my friend either! In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground! What about Prisoner X? What about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? Yeah. Leaving. I'm never thinking about any of you ever again! Man's like a stuffy child! Now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. Do you even listen to yourself when you talk? That made zero sense. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. <sighs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. What do you mean by that? Jesse. Oh right. no! No! <gasps> Why he dress up as me for? No way! Oh no! You coming? I got your back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for you. Oh, she is she actually on our side now? Oh, please, here she is, because she's actually been doing my editing the whole time. It's just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. You what? No, you don't. <laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. Oh, Petra. Oh, Sorry. I ever go about you. So, 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 so you are Petra? What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. It better be. Be annoying if it's not. Fingers crossed, in it? I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hmm. Oh, hell nah. Petra, are you crazy? We would never give up on you. Yeah, what Jesse said. Hey! Well, that's a nice thing for you to say. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. I don't care about who's wearing my face. I just want to make sure Beacon Town is safe. Yeah. Well, that won't end well, will it? We made it. Wow. Oh, nice. Should I have like this place? Jesus. Got lava everywhere. Oh, Jesus. about some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. 
get prisoner X. Huh. All right. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. I right, was jump. You know she's probably going to be like insane, right? She's going to be like kind of deranged. Because she's been on this place for God knows how long. Okay, now all we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Why are you making that seem so easy? Alright, let's go. Boom. Do it, Nurm. I've got you. You're up next, Nurm. I'll catch you. Uh, 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 there we go. The cursor is so odd in this game. Oh, there you go. Seriously, how do you do that? Saves me a job. Last jump. There we go, boom. No, this place is mad. Is that her? Yep, I told you she'd be insane. I told you. Cuckoo crazy. Um, do we really want to take the thing off her? Oh hell, nah. Who are you? I'm Jesse. Jesse, you must be prisoner X. <laughs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I, could I do. Shoot you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push, <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. Yeah, sorry to break it to you, but you're not scaring me. We're all locked up here. You're just another guest. Oh, I am so much more than that. So much more. Yeah, crazy. Prisoner X. Zara. Zara. You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? <sighs> no one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. You try to escape all the time. Why would you do that if you didn't know the way out? I get bored from time to time. I like to stretch my legs, beat up a few guards. It doesn't mean a thing. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. In it. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. Oh. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. That's funny. I call him Slimeball because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people, it's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more warden. The admin fired him. Yeah. It's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help any me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I never technically said that. Oh, so glad you changed your mind. You changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need me. I'm the only one who knows the way out. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> oh, no. That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. Oh, no. Nah. That's the situation. No one's staying behind, man. It's the only way out. We're all getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Oh, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. Oh, come on. Oh, 
I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Oh, for God's Arm. sake! Her. Her. Nerm, no, you can't do that! Arm. Oh, give me oh, strength! Come on, we seriously don't have time for this! I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. Oh, for God's sake! Why would you leave me to do this annoying choice? Oh, nah! Don't do this, man! Uh... I don't know, bring Nerm? Or bring Luna? What the hell, Telltale? <laughs> oh no, I don't know who to pick! Um, I'm gonna have to bring Nerm because um, Jackson will be very upset. And plus, he lost a lot in the series already. Yeah, I'm gonna have to bring Nerm. I'm sorry, Runa. No, Nerm. We have to go, and you need to come with me. Jack wouldn't know what to do without you. <laughs> we'll come back for Runa. Luna. Stay right there, okay? We'll come back for you. I'll come back for you, okay? You understand? Oh no, that was like the worst choice I've made, I've made in this series so far. How did you... My straight jacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. I'm sorry, Runa. No, don't look at us like that. Oh my god. Anyway, uh, we'll have to be a bit mean here. I will have to end off the episode here, but... Oh, that was a bit mean. Why would you do that, Telltale? God damn it. Why would you make me pick between Nerm and Luna? This is not fair. <laughs> and I don't even have the energy to carry on now because I feel bad. <laughs> so yeah, that's, why I'm, that's the main reason why I'm ending off the episode here. But yeah, um, that's going to be the end of this episode here. In the next episode, we're going to hopefully be escaping the prison. Because that would be nice, because I've had enough of this place, to be 100% honest with you. But yeah, um, like I said, next episode will come out in a few days' time. So, hope you tune back to see if we escape or not. I hope we do. But yeah, um, that's going to be the end of it here. Thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.